Need achievement was assessed using the thematic appreciation test. So this is some kind of special test name and it's often called TAT. So how do you do that? The first time you put it inside of parentheses and then later you would just write TAT without the parentheses. But the first time you need to write the whole word and then write the abbreviation. The distribution of reaction times was skewed. Error responses, which account for less than 1% of the responses, were eliminated from this and all subsequent analyses. And here you can see the difference in these examples. So we're inside the parentheses. If inside the parentheses you have a whole sentence, and yes, here we have the beginning of a sentence, and here is the end of the sentence. If you have a whole sentence, then the punctuation should go inside, not outside the parentheses. So this should be inside. So this one is wrong and this one is right. The three types of observers were a parents of the children being observed. Oh, I see A. This is an A. That's very hard to read. B, parents of the children who were not being observed. And C, childless adults. Okay. So remember, we can use parentheses to separate the different parts of the serial list, A, B, and C. Remember, space before, space after, and no space in between. Brown, 1959, use a similar paradigm. Why do we not use the parentheses here? Because you are already inside the parentheses, right? So when you have a citation inside, then you use commas. Students completed a demographic questionnaire and or a personality test. And or. So that sounds like they did the questionnaire and they could have done the questionnaire and the personality test, or they did the questionnaire or personality test. Students completed a demographic questionnaire, comma, a personality test, or both. And this meaning's a little bit different. So here the students completed a demographic questionnaire. That is one thing they did. They also did a personality test, or they did both. So it's a different meaning. Be careful with this and or slash. Okay, that is the long list of our examples. Hang in there. We're going to practice this more in our class in our online writing assignments. Thank you.